Ah, oh, jeez, I don't know how to describe the movie. I would just say that the name kind of sums it up the best. Just saying, it's it's called Snuff Said. That's all you need to know. Like, I, I was trying to explain this movie to someone back b before we even started filming it. And all I could tell him was that it's a horror comedy called Snuff Said. And he started laughing at that. Uh, it's just really street guys who just don't know what they're doing at all. Just trying to make a... a, a film uh obviously like we, we went, went way more for uh, the comedy than horror in that movie because it's much easier to show comedy than horror i think uh but i i do like how it goes from more of a comedy at the beginning and slowly starts to become a horror movie at the end to the point where it just becomes a straight up horror movie but besides that just tell them the name and they'll know everything it is about it very fun would be the best I could come up with. Well, you ever just want to like see a movie about people that want to kill somebody, but they're really bad at it? This is your type of movie. Well, I mean, it's a horror, so horror. Pretty much an episode of the Three Stooges, gone wrong, gone sexual. Like a social experiment, just gone wrong. If you combined a horror movie and a comedy, and they had a love child, I'd say it's three not so bright guys who, we say it's three people who really want to kill, but it's more like three guys who were smoking weed one day and thought it'd be funny to kill someone and they never came to their senses and they're just like, we totally got this guys. But none of the, their hearts aren't really in it that, well, James's character's heart's in it, but they don't really have the brains behind the operations. There's kind of like... Is watching three idiots fumble around trying to do some damage and not really going anywhere. So it's just a good movie all, all over.